Hey guys, it is Zero Two Shock here, and I'm going to show you the Shock Network Survival Server that we are going to re-release in about 12, 14, whatever hours. Um, so, okay, so I don't know who this dude's just been kind of here for a long time. It scares me. Like it really scares me. Who are you? That was cool. I forgot about that. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna go server survival. Right now it's whitelisted, and there's no portal yet. So, okay, so you spawn it, so I spawn, and then the signs right here tell you a little about the server. Oh, I still haven't changed the MOTD from prison. Um, tells you how to select some land, how to protect it, um, tells you about build portals, tells you where they are, tells you that this is a non-griefing server, we have prism on the server, and we will uh, roll back any griefing. Um, our website, where to uh, buy ranks and stuff, and then all of our donor ranks, perks, stuff are all listed here. So you get like chain boots, like uh, player vote, so you can type like slash PV1 or whatever, and you get, you know, a nice big double chest that you can access anywhere. LWC, so you can lock stuff, some little bit of money, and just a bunch of other stuff. So, okay, I'm in game mode. Obviously, you won't be in game mode when you join the server. So first, when you walk out of spawn, this is actually called City Hall. And if you notice, we are in Shockburg, owned by DRT Shock. Um, Okay, so the build portals are right over here, over this neat bridge. So basically, what these are, um, are they portals that you take take you to like a random biome. So say I really like Mega uh, Taiga Hills. I can walk through here, and then I'm in like some really interesting biome. So yeah. So then, pretty much, this is a protected area right here, but this just allows me to go to a place outside of spawn, um, or I can go build. And then say I wanted to go to a... I don't like that one, a desert. Say I want to do it to a desert, and well, here I am. So yeah. Uh, so those portals are pretty neat. We have one for, I think, six different biomes, so you can go do that. Otherwise, there are crafting benches that you can use all throughout spawn. Um, the spawn is pretty cool. It's not that big, because we didn't really want to uh, take too much attention away from the server. Um, it's pretty cute, pretty fancy. Joe Sheep built it. He's a great builder. Um, he's uh, not bad, so. Um, that was a great joke. Uh, so yeah, so you can exit spawn right here, and you can just walk around, and then if you uh, notice right here, you type slash res info, this area is still protected, so I have to go pretty far if you want to build, but pretty much this is a legit survival server that you have to collect all your own materials, um, like if you look, I mean, there's a oh, kit starter, but uh, you don't have access to any kits, no kits, no nothing, you um, have to collect all materials yourself, everything is legit, except for a few different things that you get in your donor rank, like chain armor, and what else? Oh, you can get a special spawner too with your donor rank. Um, you protect your own land by using a wooden hoe to select it, just like you did before. And other than that, we have a brand new world, um, 20,000 block radius, so you just come build a city, build whatever the heck you want, and uh, it's a pretty fun environment. This was my first server that I ever started. It's probably my favorite server. I will definitely be playing and recording on here. Um, so I hope to see people on it. Thanks.